Hello, this is Nick Stillini from Comerit Labs, and I'll be showing you ClickView 12 with a live connection to SAP HANA. The data in this dashboard is based on a global superstore. So if I'm a manager and I want to find out what's going on every July where my company sales aren't doing too well, I can simply come over here to this line chart and lasso the data points for July. Now notice how the visualizations and tables in the rest of the dashboard will automatically filter based on my selection. This dashboard also features a list box which shows us the current selections we have for a better understanding of the visualizations. To undo a selection, we can click this back button, or if we want to clear all the selections from the dashboard, we can cl press clear. Now say we want to filter our data based on a certain category of products. In this bar chart, we can click technology. This will update the line charts and tables appropriately and this selection will automatically drill down into the next group of the bar chart. From here we can explore the subcategories of technology such as phones which will show us the different models being sold. Again with every selection the rest of the dashboard will update the data to show us exactly what we want to see. If we want to see a larger version of the sales chart we can navigate to the sales sheet. Now here we can explore the individual products and see their sales and profits and to get back to the whole data set we just click clear. In the sales seasonality tab we can take a look at any month or year by just clicking in the tables. And to undo the selection we just click again. We can also export any of our data to Excel by just right clicking and press send values to Excel so we can see the raw data. Alright, now let's take a look at the profits dashboard. This dashboard features two different types of bar graphs which show information about shipping, profit, and location. As in the previous dashboard we can click a certain region and the other chart will filter based on that. We can also revert to the previous category after selection by clicking this arrow here. Let's dive deeper into Africa and take a look at the profits for all the countries. So as we can see from the blue bars, for the most part we're making money in Africa, except in Nigeria where we see this big red bar. So after clicking on Nigeria, the other chart updates itself, as well as the other visualizations and tables in our first sales seasonality dashboard. So now let's see why Nigeria is doing so poorly. Now if we hover over the categories, the bottom number is the profits. Now let's choose office supplies. Again, taking a quick peek at the profits. So we can tell that our appliances are losing us the most money. So let's filter based on that. So as we can see here, with so many appliances, it's pretty hard to see exactly what's going on in this visualization. So let's take a closer look and change to the sales sheet. Now we want to see exactly what's going on with each individual appliance sold in Nigeria. From here, if we wanted to, we could select a group of data points by lassoing. We could also hold down the control key and click each one that we wanted. And from here, again, we can export all these values to Excel by right-clicking and pressing Send Values to Excel so we can see all the raw data. Thank you for watching, and if you have any questions or concerns, you can reach out to us at comeritlabs at comerit.com.